Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Make a picture for my story that we're filming. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Today I have decided to give you a little insight in my apartment. I'm gonna do my spin on an apartment tour. We cleaned the apartment today. The perfect moment to film it. So here I'm gonna give you a little tour. So when you walk in, you start in the hallway. You have one of my favorite rooms, which is the closet. I share this with my flatmate. So this is my stuff with all the shoes. And then this is hers. We share the jackets. We have a little beauty mirror right here. Good morning, or oh, good afternoon, good evening. A lot of good memories. Then the second room that is next to the dressing is the bathroom. So when you walk in, it's like this basic bathroom. And then we always showcase a few things. I love to showcase products. So that's what we do quite often. This is kind of my beauty spot. I FaceTime in this bathroom so often. I put my phone there and then I just go stand in front of the mirror and talk to my friends on the phone. <laughs> I mean, quality time with people, right? And then we have the toilet right here, which is next to the bathroom. It's nothing totally major. I always have candles on, you will see it in the whole apartment. One of my favorite rooms in this apartment it's the living room. When I got the apartment, I was on a vacation. I wasn't going to be back home um, in time to actually visit the apartment and search for stuff. So I ordered everything online during that vacation. I just had like this layout of how the apartment would look like and the sizes. That's kind of how I built this apartment. And this turned out really nice. Again, be aware, a lot of candles, like a lot. So when you walk in, This is it. This is where I personally spend most of my time because I absolutely love this. We have our Christmas tree currently up. So this is basically the sitting area where you can sit around, watch some television, some Netflix. We have the Christmas tree, as I said before. Then we have the dining area, which I personally absolutely adore. It's currently set for dinner. And then at the end of the table, we have like this little table stuff, which like has magazines on it, candles, some fake flowers because I'm not home that much and actual flowers, um, they die quickly. We have a little couch, which is surprisingly Ikea. And I saw this um, couch in 2016 when I was just visiting Ikea. And I was like, when I get an apartment of my own, I need this couch. And then we have like these nice decorative things. Again, a lot of candles, a lot of scent stuff. Our beautiful Christmas tree, which has some very fun presents under there. <laughs> I can't wait to open these. And some of you might have already seen this. But there's a very special magazine. And then we have the kitchen, which is kind of like the most basic thing that there is in this apartment. And funny story, the first thing I bought when I moved to Amsterdam was this coffee machine. I have always wanted to have a Starbucks kind of-ish um, coffee machine. Now, very important detail, I don't drink coffee. It has been used twice, once for tea, once for coffee. Yeah. Now from the living room, we go into the second bedroom. Now this is the bedroom from my roommate. She has like these little decorative things. This was actually my sister's room when she lived with me in the beginning. Last room of the apartment, my room. It's very minimal because my work is very all over the place. I want it to be very clean, not a lot of color. The apartment doesn't have a lot of colors in it. We only work with green, blue, and a few hints of orange. Normally, this plant is where the tree is currently standing. I have to be honest, I kind of never use this because I'm always in the living room. And when you turn around, you have the bedroom with a nice nightstand, simple pillows, in almost all the frames in the apartment, there are no pictures. The only one on that half pictures are on the wall and one here on my desk. It never happened. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this. I absolutely loved living here. I'm not gonna lie. I'm kind of emotional about the fact that I'm leaving. I'll just put you there. And I would say I'll probably see you very soon.
Oliver signing out. Oh, that was right.